Hello, I'm here today with Western Oregon's head football coach, Aaron Ferguson. Coach Ferg, you guys just wrapped up fall practice right now. How'd your last scrimmage? How did fall practice go for you guys? Um, well, first of all, it's long. You know, it's a long three weeks um, through two days. Um, we've been practicing at 7 o'clock in the morning on uh, turf, and in the afternoon we've been practicing on grass, so we're trying to get uh, speed in the morning, um, and also the heat and grass in the afternoon. So those things have gone, gone well so far. Um, our team still has a long ways to go against an extremely good Grand Valley team coming in here on September 1st at 1 o'clock. Um, but they're definitely excited for that opportunity to play a nationally ranked team. Fantastic. Um, how has it been the opportunity to practice on both fields? I know that that's a big condition now where you guys are one of the only teams with grass and then you have to go play turf all the time. First of all, um, our game field, um, when everything's prepared correctly, is just like field turf. Um, it's a very good surface that we feel it keeps our guys healthy. It's a sand-based field, and we've been comp staying completely off of that. Um, next Thursday, we'll do a walkthrough on that. Um, but be, having, be able to have two separate practice areas, is, you know, because the, the surface really keeps you guys healthy. So it's helped our grass maintain. Um, so there's not holes or being able to slip. And also with our, our intramural athletic field, it's a, it's a 141 by 97, I believe. So we're able to do multiple drills and be able to tr uh, transition in the drills extremely fast because we're so close together. And the, the speed and the consistency of the surface has really helped our passing game, which you saw in our scrimmage today. Well, fantastic. Coach, we hope that translates over this here next week as you guys open up the season at home on September 1st at 1 o'clock against Grand Valley State. Okay, Thanks thank very much for the time. You bet, Danny.